Hello, can you believe the sitcom In Sickness and In Health was released 38 years ago? Many of us grew up attached to the TV screens. I think it would be fun if you and your family sat on the couch and watched this movie again with the entire cast of then and now. Where are these actors now? Who made it to Hollywood and who passed away? Find the answer in our video. Ken Campbell was born on December 10, 1941, in Ilford, Essex, England. He portrayed the character Mr. Johnson in the sitcom when he was 44 years old in 1985. We regret to inform you that in 2008, he passed away at 66, leaving us deeply saddened. I, th I thought Montgomery was out, No, Jim. he was a fellow. Well, all, all this has got, got nothing to do with the poll tax. Look, Mrs. Thatcher may have brought it in, but it's the councils. Well, at least we're trying. Just because you and your philosophers haven't made any progress for 500 years, there's no need to get peevish just because we might be. Una Stubbs was born on May 1, 1937, in Warren Garden City, Hertfordshire, England. She played the character Rita in a sitcom when she was 48 years old in 1985. We regret to inform you that in 2021, she passed away at 84, leaving us deeply saddened. And slaves for your woman, eh? Who is it who slaves like an unpaid lackey in the cosy comfort of his own? And who is it goes out and slaves to pay the rent? <laughs> Went for it. <laughs> one of my little ones said to me, are you on television, Granny? <laughs> <laughs> so cute. That's all they know. Yeah, of course. Now, will you be honest? Warren Mitchell was born on January 14, 1926, in Stoke Newington, London, England. He portrayed the character Alf Garnett in the sitcom when he was 59 years old in 1985. We regret to inform you that in 2015, he passed away at the age of 89, leaving us deeply saddened. Mr. B, wife and mother of your politician. <laughs> mother of a prime minister. Not to be it, I s- <laughs> They banned our beef out there, haven't they? Yeah, hey, yeah. but their wine makes more people ill than our beef ever did. <laughs> We've never seen our family. Hugh Lloyd was born on April 22, 1923, in Chester, Cheshire, England. He portrayed the character Mr. Carey in the sitcom when he was 67 years old in 1985. We regret to inform you that in 2008, he passed away at 85, leaving us deeply saddened. Yes, he told I said that health service is only going to benefit the sick. Yes, he said. <laughs> you've, got, you've got to be really ill before you get any benefit. So divertido. Al ser también actor, sabe cómo relajar a los actores antes de realizar una toma. A veces hace algo sumamente gracioso. Pat Coombs was born on August 27, 1926, in Camberwell, London, England. She portrayed the character Mrs. Carey in the sitcom when she was 64 years old in 1990. We regret to inform you that in 2002, she passed away at 75, leaving us deeply saddened and what's it that some men are supposed to be armed with. <laughs> but from my experience, pencil stubs are better to <laughs> The small parts. I didn't really want the stage management. No, no. I wasn't very clever at it. Well, and we had, in those days, twice nightly rep. They couldn't afford <laughs> a, a new tea set. Eamon Walker was born on June 12, 1962, in London, England. He portrayed the character Winston in the sitcom when he was 23 years old in 1985. He is now living happily at 61. My sister's getting married, Mr. Garnet. You ain't invited me. They're gonna have to move into my mum's. And I want my rum, see? Well, it's hard luck, innit? Well, I thought... Let me go this. And then suddenly, over the course of time, Bowden's voice came and was developed in a hotel room. And with lots of tapes and, you know... Vas Blackwood was born on October 19, 1962, in London, England. He portrayed the character Peel in the sitcom when he was 27 years old in 1989. He is now living happily at the age of 60. Still no need to bring cinema rabbits to Abel. Charles Lawton was portraying how primitive man would behave. Oh, yeah. yeah. Primitive man ate with his fingers. Henry VIII was a raw... ...loved me because um, he was the one that gave me the line, Shat Addo. Yeah, yeah, he said, he said, say it like that. Yeah, yeah, because I was doing... Carmel McSherry was born on August 18, 1926, in Dublin, Ireland. She portrayed the character Mrs. Hollingberry in the sitcom when she was 59 years old in 1985. 
We regret to inform you that in 2018, she passed away at 91, leaving us deeply saddened. Your counsel tell them it's me! James Ellis was born on March 15, 1931, in Belfast, Northern Ireland. He portrayed Michael in the sitcom when he was 61 years old in 1992. We regret to inform you that in 2014, he passed away at 82, leaving us deeply saddened. I'm a letter. Yeah. He, I'm a letter. He'll have a letter. Put in the bank if anything happens to him. In the yes. bank. To be opened on demise, requested autopsy. Yes. Arthur English was born on May 9, 1919, in Aldershot, Hampshire, England. He portrayed the character Arthur in the sitcom when he was 66 years old in 1985. We regret to inform you that in 1995, he passed away at the age of 75, leaving us deeply saddened. I think it's the same old crowd uh, running up there that's got it all down there. <laughs> From my experience, and what I've... Harry Fowler was born on December 10, 1926, in Lambeth, London, England. He portrayed the character Harry in a sitcom when he was 59 years old in 1985. We regret to inform you that in 2012, he passed away at the age of 85, leaving us deeply saddened. What's your game? What's my game? I thought we'd break it gone wrong. Oh, yeah. Now, come on, off. Off? Off! Don't you tell me off, mate. I'm warning. <laughs> hey! Dandy Nichols was born on May 21st, 1907, in Fulham, London, England. She portrayed the character Alice Garnett in the sitcom when she was 78 years old in 1985. We regret to inform you that in 1986, she passed away at 78, leaving us deeply saddened. <laughs> no good for my eyes. No, no good for my eyes. Arnold Diamond was born on April 18, 1915, in West Ham, Excess, England. He portrayed the character Mr. Rubinsky in the sitcom when he was 70 years old in 1985. We regret to inform you that in 1992, he passed away at 76, leaving us deeply saddened. Talk to him for hours, but uh, you have no chair. I have no chair. If you don't mind my saying, and I'm older than you, this is today's. Who is your favorite character in the sitcom in sickness and in health? If you like the video, I invite you to hit the like button. And if you like this type of content, you can also hit subscribe. This is Turn Back Time and I hope you have a great day.